Last week, I received a comment saying, I'm an online teacher. Can you teach me how to make a tutorial video on YouTube? I thought that was a great idea. So today, I'm going to break down the steps to help you create your own tutorial videos. Let's get started. First step. I usually make my tutorials two or three times to figure out the best and easiest way for my audience to understand it. This way, I know the best process for the topic I want to talk about. So, you should practice to have complete control over your tutorial. Second step. Which tool is best for screen recording? I've used different tools for recording, and the most stable and high-resolution one I've found is Wondershare Demo Creator. First, head over to Google and type Wondershare Demo Creator in the search bar, or simply click the first link in my description to go directly to the download page. Once you're there, download the software and install it on your PC. After installation, you'll see this window pop up. This is the main interface of Wondershare Demo Creator. You'll notice two buttons, Video Recorder and Video Editor. First, let's click on Video Recorder. This tool is not only for screen recording, it has six recording modes. Screen recording, screen camera recording, camera recording, game recording, virtual avatar recording, video presentation. To customize your webcam look, start by going to the screen section and selecting a border style that suits you best. You can choose between circle and rectangle overlays, each offering different effects, including white, blue, colorful, and even animated options. In the editing stage, you can make further adjustments to the webcam border. You also have options to enhance your appearance, like adjusting skin tone, brightening, and even reducing chin size. Once you're satisfied with the result, hit the red button to start recording. That's how you can look great on a webcam without spending a lot. You can use screen drawing tools like pen, draw or write on screen to highlight something. If you make a mistake while drawing, just undo or redo your changes. Highlight. Click and drag over the text or part you want to emphasize. See how I highlighted this part? It helps the viewer focus better. Text. Click on text, choose your font size and color, and start typing. You can move the text anywhere you want. I like to write notes like, use animation or don't forget to turn on the free layer on modify. Shapes. Use shapes to highlight important parts, like here with effect settings. You can choose from rectangles, circles, arrows, or lines. When you're done teaching and want to remove all the text and arrows, you can remove them with one click or use the eraser to clean them one by one. AI teleprompter. If you're doing a video presentation and forget everything like me, no worries. The AI teleprompter can help you when you're talking in front of the camera. Just click, type your text, and if you're a pro, you can write key points to help you perform better. Smart Zoom. You think the features are done? Nope. Let me show you a preset for recording called Smart Zoom. It automatically zooms in to make your tutorials and demos easier to follow, grabbing more attention. The presets are customizable so you can change them later during editing to speed up your workflow. Just be careful not to move your mouse too much unnecessarily. Cursor Highlight. You can change your cursor's color, red, blue, or yellow. I suggest using yellow because it pops on the screen, making it easier for viewers to follow. Hotkey shortcuts help viewers learn faster, so make sure to include them when you're teaching. AI Voice Cleaner. If you're working from home like me, you'll want to remove background noise. Demo Creator lets you apply AI Voice Cleaner to improve your audio. High Quality Video Recording. To ensure the best quality, go into Settings and change the frame rate to 60 or 120 FPS. For 4K recording, your monitor should be 4K. Demo Creator also offers continuous and stable recording for up to 24 hours, with versatile capture options, even cross-screen recording. Why not CapCut? Because Demo Creator has features that make editing tutorial videos more engaging. Once you import your video into the timeline, you'll see yellow and purple arrows. These are the zoom-in presets I used while recording. You can change the speed of zooms by adjusting these. You can delete them if you think the camera movement is unnecessary for that part. or add e new animations like pan to bottom right or left, or zoom in, zoom out. If you want to zoom back out, use restore original or manually adjust the zoom level. 
If you double click on the arrows, you can manually choose how much to zoom in. Just choose an area for your animation. If your rectangle is too big, the animation will be slower. And remember to set the ratio to original. When everything looks good, click OK. Audio editing. You can also enhance your voice and audio using audio effects. I've created a cut between the clips to showcase my voice before and after applying the effects. Now, let me add voice effects to the video as well. You'll be able to clearly hear the difference and see how much the effects enhance the clarity. On the right side, you'll find settings you can adjust to get the best results, as each voice is unique. Let's listen to my voice before and after applying the effects for a coffee brand. So, as you can hear, my voice should be clear. Today, I want to show you how to see how much clearer it sounds. Apply voice changer effect to your video layer, and a window will pop up. Choose any character you want. You can sound like a girl, an old man, or even a child. Let me apply the Amy voice. After processing, you can review it before applying. Today, I want to show you how to create motion graphics for a coffee brand. So, as you can hear, my voice should be clear. And as you can hear, my voice has changed. Now you can call me Mrs. Amy. If you're happy with the voice, just click OK. Sometimes you record a video with music playing in the background, which can cause copyright issues on YouTube. Here, you can apply AI Vocal Remover to separate the audio from your voice. Let's listen to my video with the song first. Today, I want to show you how to create motion graphics for a coffee brand. So, as you can hear, my voice should be clear. Now, after applying the AI Vocal Remover, we'll see how well it separates the vocals from the song layer. First, let's see if my voice has been removed from the song. Now let's check my vocal. Today, I want to show you how to create motion graphics for a coffee brand. So, as you can hear, my voice should be clear. Hmm, nice. To make my voice sound even better, you can also use voice cleaner to enhance it. I'll show you how to create motion graphics for a coffee brand. So, as you can hear, my voice should be clear. You can also mute the song or reduce the volume if you think it's too loud. You can highlight your cursor this way to capture more attention, making it easier for viewers to follow your mouse movements. Create cuts for the in and out areas, then apply the effect only to those segments. For a little zoom in effect on specific parts, let's add cursor magnify so viewers can see the numbers better. Alternatively, you can use cursor spotlight to focus on important areas. On the right side, you can adjust the settings to make the spotlight circle bigger, or increase the darkness around the cursor for more emphasis. By using arrows, circles, or rectangles with animation, you can highlight important words, numbers, or areas. Just add these elements to the timeline, resize, or move them as needed. On the right side, you can adjust the color and thickness of the border to customize the look of your elements. Subtitles. To make your videos more engaging, add subtitles. Click here. Choose a language, then click Generate. You can customize the text, font size, style, and even add animations. I like the one with the words popping up on screen. If you don't like the background, you can remove it in the settings. Video effects. 
You can also use effects like mosaic to hide parts of the video. Or remove unwanted objects using AI Object Remover. Simply select the part you want to hide, and it will turn green. Review it before applying the effect. If you want to hide a different area, just remove the selection and choose a new one. The AI Beauty Filter can enhance your appearance, but make sure not to overdo it and lose your natural look. Templates Demo Creator offers a variety of templates that can be used for different projects. You can edit them by clicking on the template layer, then import your video into the timeline and customize the text and title. These templates work similarly to Photoshop files, allowing you to adjust the template settings to fit your needs. So, whether you're gaming, teaching, presenting, or creating faceless content like me, Wondershare Demo Creator has everything you need to take your videos to the next level. It's flexible, powerful, and super easy to use. Click the first link in the description to give it a try. And remember, as always, stay creative. Cheers.